obviously a lot of thought was put into it with um you know the uh training the costuming etc cetera, etc cetera. do you know why uh the truth commission didn't last uh a, you know an extended period of time well the truth commission was was bret hart's uh i don't want to say baby but it was it was bret hart's uh, partly his ideal uh brett had been over doing the, from what i understand from robin uh Brett had been over in South Africa doing uh, a Sinbad episode and he met Robin Smith, the original commandant there. And they started talking about this thing and, and Brett came back and pitched it to Vince and Vince liked it. And uh, so we were kind of a br uh, uh, Brett's deal. And, and if you think back uh, this, you know, when we got up there, it was 1997 and soon to roll around was survivor series, 1997 where Brett was leaving the company and, you know, uh, they were going in a different direction. And, and then, you know, the, the survivor series in Montreal, that's where it all went down. So, uh, you know, I think with Brett leaving that, that probably didn't help. Uh, but I don't know that, you know, that, um, they, they had other ideals. Uh, once, after Robin left, uh, Don Callis came in and, uh, Don was a, a tremendous, I mean, great on the mic, great on the mic, but was just as good of a worker that never really got to, to show that at least in WWE. And it was a shame because, uh, you know, I remember sitting outside the dressing room one night, uh, he was doing a singles match. I think with Scotty, uh, Scotty too hotty at the time, uh, maybe even before he was at Scotty Goldman, I guess at the time. Um, so he went out and done a singles match. We were having a, a tag match later on. And I remember standing there watching him, you know, uh, I, Robert and, uh, and, uh, uh, Luke Poirier who came in later as a sniper, they were both Canadian and they had worked a lot up in Montreal. So, so, uh, you know, they knew, him. uh, I didn't know, uh, uh, Luke, but, uh, Luke came in with us and, uh, uh, yeah, we just rocked right on along. Kenny Bolin uh, says, hi, Bol, want to go to the movies? <laughs> Absolutely, I do, Kenny. 